Hi, in this video, I will explain how to use the library view within IntelliConnect. In addition to tree view, library view is another format to view your content in IntelliConnect. Library view lays out your content in a single page organized by topical areas, and it makes it easy to find information of interest to you. In IntelliConnect, you can view your content in a traditional tree view, or you can view your content on menu pages. The menu pages format is called library view. By default, your content displays in a tree view. You can toggle between these two views at any time. To switch to the library view format, just click library view at the top of the left side pane. Remember that you can return to the tree format anytime by clicking the tree view link. When you select the library view, you will see all the libraries you subscribe to displayed as links. Your My Favorites library that you saved is also available. To view a library, just click on the link. The entire contents of the library you selected will display on one single page. Keep in mind that you can also selectively search for keywords, any service or section of a service displayed on the screen by clicking the checkbox next to it. This is the same that you would do in tree format. With no services checked, you are searching all the content that you subscribe to. Now let's continue to browse through the Tax Research Consultant in order to find a document of interest. When you select the document from the list, the document details displays on the right side pane with the menu where the document resides displayed on the left side pane. To return to the main screen, just click All Contents in the menu path. Notice that My Favorites is displayed as the starting library. Let's look at how easily you can set a different starting library. Let's say you want to set the Federal Tax Library to be your starting library. Just click that library and then click the option Make This My Starting Library. You'll see that the library has a push pin associated with it. This will remind you that this is your starting library. To change your starting library, just repeat the steps. Select the library and then click the option Make This My Starting Library. Thank you for watching this video. For additional training resources, click the link below to visit our training and consulting webpage.